So I've been reading this biosensing article in Make Volume 26. Among other things, it covers how to use a mindset brainwave sensor to control an Arduino. And it also outlines how to access the data from this device on your computer. And it got me thinking, could I use my brainwaves to generate music? Hmm. Well, probably, right? The Mindset is a relatively affordable EEG device that works wirelessly over Bluetooth. It measures the very small voltages created by brain activity and then calculates separate frequency levels from those measurements. Each frequency is associated with a particular mental state, for example, theta waves are linked to drowsiness, alpha waves to relaxation, and beta waves are associated with alertness. Consciously controlling your own brainwave levels can be quite a challenge, and at first glance, these individual levels can seem pretty random. But when I compose music on my computer, I often use random values to mix things up a bit, such as to add some variation to a looping beat. So why not use my own brainwave frequencies to compose an electronic drum beat? To do so, I wrote a program in processing with the help of a couple specially written code libraries, one to handle communicating with the mindset and another to send notes as MIDI data to my music software. First, I made a list of patterns to use as note sequences. Each number will determine where a note occurs within an eight note sequence. Each brainwave frequency is assigned to its own percussion instrument. Theta waves will play the kick drum, alpha waves control the snare, beta are on the cymbals, and gamma controls the tom drum. Each frequency's level will determine which pattern from my list is currently being played. Along with those frequency levels, the mindset also sends out special values that supposedly gauge one's current level of attention and meditation. I'll use those to control a couple of effects which will change the overall sound of my beat. It's worth mentioning, I had recurring problems communicating with the mindset from Mac OS 10.6. So if you try this, you might consider using a Windows or Linux operating system to avoid some frustration. Okay, I've got my processing sketch running. Ableton Live is ready to receive MIDI data. My sensor is in place. And all I have to do is start the sequencer here. Okay, I'll try closing my eyes and relaxing now. It definitely slowed down in response to, well, maybe my eyes being closed, but it would seem the relaxation factor. Now I'll do some uh, 
basic math in my head. It is pretty dynamic. It could be cool to use this for controlling synthesizer parameters or maybe some high power LEDs. Strobe lights? Heck, you could have your own brain rave. <laughs>